Hey, so first fight, BKFC. How you feeling, bare knuckle? What's up? How you feeling now? We got the win. We did what we came to do. Um, you know. Uh, this is Platinum Mike Perry coming to you live from backstage. Uh, the weather report shows signs of rain, the color of blood, and uh, the stadium was raining. Cheers from the crowd for Platinum Mike Perry. Um, you know, I gave it my best shot in there. I tried to get rid of him. I hit him right away. And, um, you know, I was just happy to have a great fight. I hope everyone enjoyed it. There was a little talk. You kept talking to him after the fight. What happened there? You know, I told him afterwards as well. After that, I said thank you for hearing what I had to say. And he kind of told me, you know, it's all love at the end. So what I was telling him was I get what he was doing, but there were some ways he did it wrong. And, you know, even if he didn't know that the bat was a plastic bat right away, don't bring my family into it. Don't bring other people's family. I would never do that. It's between you and me. And and he he gave me the nod because he understands because he's a family man and a man of God, so he says. So, you know, we all grew tonight. I said that at the press conference. I said all the fans are here to see us. They already knew it was going to be a great fight. He was very tough. You know, my hands and his face were about even as tough as each other. So, you know, I just need to block a little more. I don't really care about getting hit. I just, I just be standing there like, oh, I don't care. And, uh, you know, he blocked. So I got my lesson, and I still got the win. I'm a knucklehead. All right, so is Burn Knuckle the sport for you? Is it a good fit for you? Absolutely. Let's go. I mean, how is it not a good fit for me? I showed, you know, I'm unfazed. I'm un, you know, I'm not unscathed, but I'm unfazed. I don't care about any of that. It's just, okay, I got to work on my hands, strengthening them. I'm going to start punching concrete bricks. Wait till you see that shit, boy. Right, Drop the mic. Drop the mic because I'm going home. I ain't going to drop his mic. It's probably expensive. I was just playing. <laughs>